Hi guys, it's Abby, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. So I'm just currently chilling in my room and basically I'm gonna be doing a bit of a declutter video for you guys ready for January. So after Christmas, I've got some obviously new presents. If you, have, if you guys haven't seen that video, then I'll leave a link down below of what I got for Christmas. Basically, I've got some new presents I need to sort it out, put it into the right places, sort out my body shop at home, consultant stock, sort out my clothes and stuff like that. I'm just sort of bringing you guys along with me for a bit of like a makeup to cut out, jewelry to sort out when I've sort my jewelry out into my new jewelry box. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Please don't mind how rough I look. Um, it's just a really chill video and I hope it brings you guys some entertainment. We've just been in that Christmas period of just like chilling out. Like I'm sure hopefully you guys have had that too. Where you're just relaxing, chilling out. And obviously now we are in tier four in my local area. So there's not really much else to do. And I definitely am in need of a clear. I can't even show you guys. It's too embarrassing. Oh, we don't have that one. Charlie's just played Animal Crossing. If you know Animal Crossing, then I'll say this quick thing. If you don't know about Animal Crossing, then skip forward. But we're catching the fish to try and pay for the house. And, like, Charlie's finding the new ones, which is really good to donate them to the owl. <laughs> I sound like a lunatic if you don't play Animal Crossing. But if you do, then, like, Charlie's helping me get loads of fish to, like, pay off my house. To, like, sell them and stuff. And, like, get nook miles. Um, if you don't have Animal Crossing, then I definitely recommend getting it. This is the situation we are dealing with at the minute. Let me just move everything out the way. So all my Christmas cards are going to be thrown away. This is the one that Lisa and my dad got me. <laughs> it's really cool. It's Percy Pig. But yeah, unfortunately, all of them are going to go away in the bin. Apart from the one that Lee got me, so you'll see it's personalised. Everything in the bin, because sometimes rubbish can miss the bin. I just have this bin. It's just really simple. It's from Ikea. Just classic. Don't, none of you care about my bin. <laughs> But if you if you if you did care about the bin, there you go. Basically, I got my recycling thing ready. I got some Christmas cards. Oh, I don't want to throw them away. I'm gonna throw that one away because oh no, it's just, oh, they're just too cute. They're from my little brother and sister. I can't throw them. So I've just got like some bowls. Um, I got my Foreo charger and stuff like that. So basically, this area is very messy. I'm gonna be basically sorting out, you know, all the Christmas packaging. It's crazy how much packaging there is and stuff. So like these brushes. And throwing the box away because it's just crazy how much packaging you get with things nowadays and this one isn't too bad i'm gonna pop it in the case this is the case i spoke about in my what i got for christmas video oh that is so soft i feel that <laughs> joe just said don't throw that away thanks <laughs> don't no i won't that is something i do though that's the thing, I'm so, I'm a person which actually constantly checks. Um, you know, like when you're throwing something away, you have to like constantly check. Like, oh, did I accidentally put that in the bin or something? When I do orders for the body shop, I have to literally check it out like 500 times because I'm like, did I put anything in there that shouldn't be in there? I know some of you are going to hate the fact I'm doing this. <laughs> I can see you guys being angry with it. Is this a silly idea? Basically, this sort of box was takes up quite a bit of room. So I was thinking of putting them in here. I think that's a good idea. Matt's packaging gone, see, and now it's down into this. That's a good little hack there. This is a calendar which I got, and I love it. I've had it for like a year now, and we can just keep using it every year. It's a constant flip it over. I love that. Yeah, let me show you before of my desk. This is a before, like, look, gold coin wrapper. I obviously had the Frere Rocher box. You know, I've got all of these little gold coin wrappers. You know, I think that's an actual gold coin. I'll have to be sorting all of this out. I can put my gold coins in my loot box as well. My mum's going to come in and think I've literally eaten all my Christmas chocolate and be like, oh my God. But secretly, it's all in here. Uh, so, this is my little makeup caddy, which I keep my makeup in. Um, I've got my little jewellery stand, got my little pot with hair bands in and money, because I always use my hair bands. I've got my little drawers, which just have like little bits and bobs in. Nothing really exciting. Got my makeup brushes. As you would have seen in my what I got for Christmas video, I got some new makeup. Um, so I got 
a new foundation brush which is just so lovely and i've had this one for like over a year and it is crusty that is criminal so that is going in the bin and this is the new one i mean look at the difference this is a heart that lee made me out tin for <laughs> um, i've got this mascara that i got a new one for christmas and they say to keep your mascaras every six months change them don't they they say to change your mascaras every six months so in no in with the i can't remember the say in with the old out with the new out with the old in with the new so also i've literally just ran out of the number seven luminous water surge gel so that can go in the bin i'm guessing that this is recyclable once i've cleared it out because it's glass then i've literally ran out of this yesterday so it makes way for my brand new one i'm, I'm gonna save these because I'm going to put them in the makeup recycling at Tesco's. It is this gorgeous. <gasps> Look at that. That is literally lovely. <laughs> I'm so excited about that. Also got this mascara to donate because um, I bought it in an Amazon haul. And I, I don't really get on with it. I keep all my everyday makeup in this little carrier. Although I should probably try and put it out now. Because it's probably not going to really go out anywhere. Let me just set you up. So that's my makeup situation. I've got my jewellery here, but that's going to be being put in my jewellery box. So I'll just pop it there for a minute. I've got my little compacts. So this is the before. I've also got all these batteries as well, which I can get rid of, which I can get rid of. But you mustn't throw batteries away. I didn't know this. That my brother taught me. So I put these it in the starts bowl. Fires. It starts fires. If it at... goes in an electrical bit, if it goes in the recycling bin, it'll because when because the machine's flatten it down. Yeah, so basically. And then it'll flatten the battery down and cause a spark and it'll start a fire. Yeah, so basically, don't throw your batteries in a normal bin or recycling bin because it starts fires. Oh look, a bit of satisfying. How satisfying is that? So yeah, basically all these drawers which just have random bits in. My A necklace that Lee got me. So that'll be going in my jewellery box as well. I've got this which belongs in my car. And now I've got me these new picture frames. Which are really cute. I thought that they would look cute up here. And like these are in the um, Zoella Sug, the little pots. See how that looks cute. That looks a lot better. I should have taken a picture before and after. Maybe I can get a screenshot. So these are all my makeup palettes. And I've got one over here as well. I need to figure out a bit more of a better kind of way to slot them all in. So I'm I'm basically just going to go through them and look. So this, I mean, this one's good. It's not really used. So I'll keep that one. It's more just about how I'm going to slot them in. Let me put you like that. Is that better? And you can see I've got this one, which has never been used. I've got the tatty lashes that Fliss got me, which I'm definitely keeping for after lockdown is over. My lipsticks, apple taffy from the body shop. And I've got this Morphe palette, which I love. 35H palette which just lives at the back. I need to get more use out of it. And then I've got the Living My Best Light highlights palette from Beauty Bay. Um, and I've got this Beauty Bay palette which which is definitely getting old now. I don't know, I just love it. I don't want to get rid of it. Also got this for Christmas which I'm gonna put in. So it's got two brushes to add to the collection. That is just so nice. It's got gorgeous eyeshadows and highlights. So that is gorgeous. I'll be replacing this um, and popping it in the makeup bin because it's just had its day and those are really similar shades. And I've had it for a year and you know, they say only a year. Probably only say that because to make more money, but you know, that's what they say. My eyebrow stuff. 
I'm just gonna keep sorting this out, guys, and I'll get back to you once it's been a bit more sorted out. So I've just been sorting it all out, um, all the different bits and bobs. So I've just got some different places that I've put in all of the things. It's, and Lee got this for me from when we went to the Sherlock Holmes Museum. So I'm gonna pop this um, in the book that my mum got me for Christmas. Um, I'll just pop it in there ready when I read it. This has got paperwork in it, but it also has some face masks. So I'm just gonna take these out and pop them in here. Here, ready to be used. And they're just nicely out of the way. I've got my hairbrush in there. This one's my favorite, the, the wet brush. Got it from Amazon. Hmm. So let's wipe in my side. Now I'm gonna sort through my jewelry box. I'm just gonna use a sticker on my laptop. I got it fixed by them, and then they put this sticker on there to say what's been done to it. And then I literally cannot get it off. So if anyone has any tips how to get these kind of stickers off. But this is the jewelry box. So now this is the before, and then I'm gonna show you once I've sorted all my jewelry into it. sorting out these areas down here and um, so the first thing is, is I have this box full of stuff so for example I'm just gonna be getting rid of things which had way too long like this Abercrombie and Fitch Lee got it for me literally two years ago now on our first Christmas so this is 24 months old it's basically just gonna be watching me clearing stuff out <laughs> into a box like when I run out of things so I've got my eyeshadow palettes in here my like extra ones for when my like, old my my older ones run out I've got my new Foreo face masks when my other pack runs out I've got moisturizers when my other ones run out and just you know all the little bits here is a before and you're about to see the after so cue the time Tan's definitely had its day. I have all these nail varnishes which I need to clear out. I don't want to part with them, but like, I mean, I've had that way longer than a year. You can probably tell, so I've got to throw it away. Well, donate it in them. I think I can donate it in the makeup thing. I've got this one as well. I think I've had it longer than time. I don't know, how long do people usually... Oh, that one's 30 months. And I've got these little ones. Oh, it's just so sad to get rid of them though. I just don't want to do it. Mm, but yeah, me and Amelia is going to go through it. I mean, this one's yeah. a newer one that I have. So basically, this is... One. Yeah, that I got Amelia. Oh, they can't see Amelia. Put it back. Push, put it back a bit. There we go. Right there. So yeah, this is my little nail varnish bag. I'm still going to keep a bit. Just some of them that I've had yeah. ages that I look and, and I'm like... And another frozen one. Yeah, another frozen one. Yeah, just some of Where's them that I look one? at and I'm Where's like, I've one? had these Where's for a long time. One? We got rid of five nail varnishes you can't even see there's a bag back there but it's better than nothing and we barely have any so we've got like 20 so getting rid of five is actually like a quarter of them here is the finish part so i just have a dumbbell down there i think it's called a dumbbell whether it's called that weight which i brought but yeah i think it's just perfect now I've got all my extra makeup products and bits of that extra geodes and stuff like that that i'll need but i've rolled on so i've got a new one out um, and I've got stock behind the Airbury shop and then some bits that I'm using. Got Lee's spray, got all the books. These are the ones I need to read. So got those two for Christmas. Got that one for myself as a little birthday treat. So we Sugg's new one with Amy McCulloch. I got this World About the Girl one, which I need to read. And then I want to read the third one of the series. So I've got plenty to get through. Uh, and then down there I've got, um, I've got, um, like little books and bits of bobs here um, and then behind there I've got like programs from theatre shows I've got the memory book that Lee really kindly made me for our anniversary just so sweet 
to is just remember when and it's loads of pictures of stuff that we've done together. So here it is guys, the finished bit of the desk. So it's just so much better, cleaner and clearer. And obviously my lovely mirror that Lee got me just looks so nice and there's everything complete. So I hope this gave you guys some inspiration to clean up your room ready for January or have a clear out. But the makeup um, looks so much clearer. It's just got my favorite bits in. And then when I need anything replenishing, I can just go down there and grab it. So yeah, thanks so much, guys. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.